hi guys and welcome back to my channel so today what I want to do is a tag I was tagged by two wonderful youtubers by the name of Matthew likes LV and pink cookie girl 1982 and the tag is called confessions of a purse of ho purse so my husband's actually gonna help me to um, read the questions because I recorded this before but I didn't like the way I was looking down so he agreed to read the questions to me so I don't have to you don't have to see the top of my head so mm -hmm. with that <laughs> thank you babe with that said we're gonna get started question number one what is your favorite style of purse okay I have three favorite styles and the reason why I have three is because they're for different purposes. So as you already know, my first style is when I'm with my kids and it is the Bloomsbury PM. And if you haven't seen it, this is how it looks. And I like this style because it is a crossbody. It allows me to be completely hands free. So that's my first favorite. My second favorite, this is when I'm also with my kids, but I have help, my hubby's with me. I'm, I'm not just solo with them, and I like a hobo style. And this would be my second style, which is a shoulder bag, and it's a hobo, and this is the Galera. And the reason why I like that, you're still able to be hands-free but in cases where you don't need to be completely hands-free with your kids or in any situation you can still be really stylish with a um, shoulder bag so i like that one and then lastly of course a classic style would be the handheld and that would be a speedy or any type of handheld bag i, I like that as well and i like i prefer handheld when i'm completely kid free question number two Okay. Do you call it a purse, a bag, or a handbag? Okay, so this is really funny, guys. I am so old school, really. I don't call it a purse, a... What was the other one? Hand, well, I do now. Okay, so let me just say. Before I became purse form, the purse form savvy and YouTube savvy, I called it a pocketbook, okay? Some of you may be familiar with the term pocketbook. Some of you may not, but it is an old terminology used for a handbag or purse. I got it from my mom, my grandmom, and I still use it to this day. But because I'm savvy now, I watch YouTube videos, and I'm on a purse forum, I call it a handbag or a bag. Next question. What is your go-to purse? My go-to purse would have to be the Bloomsbury or a handheld so I would say a speedy would be a good choice Next one. yes babe. what is your least favorite purse trend you know I'm really not that trendy so I don't really have a purse trend I typically like to get classic bags but one I don't know if it's considered a trend but one thing I really wasn't fond of were the um, the juicy bags that had the big, it, I don't know the type of material it is, but um, is it? Like fur? No, it's not fur. It's the cloth, but it's like, is it, is it velour? Not velour. I'm not sure, but well, anyone, okay. yes, okay. anyone that knows about juicy, those big juicy bags, it's made out of their jumpsuits. I'm really not a fan of that. So if that's a trend, I would say that's a trend that I'm not too fond of. What's your most expensive bag? My most expensive bag to date would have to be my my artsy, and this is it. So that would be my most expensive, my currently my most expensive bag. I have an eye on another one, but this is the most expensive for now. What is your most used bag? Wow, you know I really rotate my bags, so I would say the majority of them get a lot of use. But I would say the most used would be um, a, a Speedy and my Bloomsbury. Those would be the two that I use most. And also a Neverfull. My Neverfull, I use that quite often as well. And the least used bag? The least used bag, I would, okay, yeah. This beauty, and, and before I show you this bag, I just want you guys to know, I love this bag. It is a beautiful, classic bag. It goes with everything. But the reason why I don't use it that often, and this, it is my, 
my Trevi PM. I love it. I just don't find myself pulling for it the most, but I really need to start using it because it is a really, really cute bag. But as of right now, I would have to say this is my least used. Okay. What are your most wanted purses right now? Or what is your, what is on your wish list? Okay. So I have a couple of things on my wish list. So let's start with um, purses. Right now I'm pretty content with my purse collection. However, I do want a, it's a multicolor, the black multicolor Courtney clutch. And guys, check this out. I found two of them on eBay. They want two grand for that clutch and I am not going to spend two grand because it's not worth two grand. I've done my research and I tried to negotiate with the seller but she wasn't having it so I didn't purchase it. So that's what I'm looking for currently and what I want that's not purse related. I want a pair of shoes. I want the Amarant um, Oxford flats. Those are so cute. I also want the a belt. I want a belt in the Abeen print, the LV initials belt, and lastly, and my husband is listening, for my anniversary, I want the LV. You don't have to look this way. <laughs> I want the LV um, leopard um, stall by Steven Sprouse. Yeah, hopefully he gets it. Okay, next question. How many bags or purses <laughs> do you own? Okay, I own. 12 full-size bags and then I own three clutches so together if you want to include my bags and my clutches 15 in all I'm adding my own question <laughs> my baby's items. adding <laughs> how many Louis items do you have period because I don't even know that's a shame he doesn't know um maybe 30 maybe I don't know I haven't counted okay back to the other <laughs> what is your favorite special occasion purse Okay, it would have to be the Eva. This is such a versatile bag clutch because it looks really nice on an on an evening out. Also, if you're just chilling with some jeans, you can throw this on, use it crossbody. But I would definitely say my Eva clutch is a great special occasion bag. And until I get the Courtney, that will be another one. But I don't have that, so I would have to say the Eva. Where's your favorite place to buy your handbags? Favorite places would be at the boutique, at the Louis Vuitton boutique, online at um, their website, louisvuitton.com. And surprisingly, because I had some great experiences with secondhand pre-loved items, I really like um, the, what do you call those sites? The, oh, I'm sorry guys. They're called consignment websites that I've been lucky on like Mallory's I've purchased um yeah so and I'm looking at eBay now so not bad save some money okay purses you regret buying okay this purse right here I love it it's really cute it, it brings a pop of color but it is so small guys I really want to show you how it looks inside it is really small but it, it's a really cute purse. If I would, if I could do it all over again, I probably would have held the money that this costs and put it towards a bigger clutch because you really can't hold much in this. But I, I still love it. I still wear it. But if I had one regret, this would be it. And this is the Multicolor Miller MM. Okay, your favorite purse. Ooh, my favorite purse. I don't even think I have it here with me. I would say my Speedies and my Almas. And I don't even bring one of my Almas out, but that would have to be my favorite in a Bloomsbury. That would be my favorite as well. And favorite accessory? My favorite accessory, it would have to be this little baby right here. This is a very small accessory, one of the more affordable accessories, but you know what? You can do so many things with this. Currently, I have my change in here, but this weekend I took my kids to SeaWorld and this is the only thing that I took with me. So it ha it housed my IDs, my my IDs, 
my money, my debit card, and it was so convenient. And I actually just clipped it onto my belt, my not my belt, my pants loop, and put it in my front pocket. It's very convenient. So if you don't have one of these, it's called a, I believe a coin pouch. It's very convenient and I love it. So that would have to be my most favorite accessory. Okay, what do you always carry in your bag? I really carry the same things. I carry this Gucci cosmetic pouch, but I don't keep cosmetics in here because I carry my Louis Vuitton cosmetic pouch. I carry my coin pouch, my keys, my agenda, my extra card case, and when I have my contacts on, or even if I don't know, I just still carry my shades in here if my bag is large enough. Okay guys, so that was the entire tag. So I just want to thank you guys for tagging me, and I'm, I'm very sorry it took me forever to load this i like i said i tried to um tape before the lighting was bad and i was not organized so hopefully this was a uh, more organized than my original one but thank you guys and anyone that that have not done this tag please feel free to join in because it's really a good tag and i would love to see your answers so until next time you have a good day